Hey guys, it's Jessica. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you're new. Today I'm going to be doing the July 2020 Ipsy unbagging. I'm sorry if it's late. It was put apparently in the wrong mailbox. I sent a complaint saying I didn't get it. And then all of a sudden it was in my mailbox and said wrong box on it. So I'm assuming it got delivered to the wrong place and they were a good person. So the first thing that's in the box obviously is this card called it says take a break I guess that's the theme of this month your ultimate beauty subscription it doesn't have any of the products on it so I had to write down everything this is what the bag looks like this month it's pretty cute it says escape on it, it has a little airplane there I thought that was really cute um, it smells like a uh, kid floaties that you blow up when you put them in the pool and it's a little bit see-through and plasticky but it's still cute now the first thing that came in my bag is this Bella Pierre banana powder in the shade medium I've I've already tried this powder and it's pretty good I thought it was really glittery at first and then I realized it was my brush so that's my bad but it's really good powder works with my skin tone pretty well it's a banana setting powder in the shade medium it's supposed to be long wearing crease proof and it's supposed to minimize dark circles and redness this is the full size it has four grams of product in it and the retail price for that is thirty five dollars so that already pays for my bag plus some that's pretty good the next thing I got is this Brow Power by It Cosmetics. This is what it looks like. On one side it has a spoolie and on the other side is the product. I've already tried this, it's what I'm wearing right now. Basically it's supposed to be universal so the harder you use it then the darker it will be. And I was a little skeptical because you can use it on blonde hair types and obviously my eyebrows are pretty freaking dark, but it worked for me. So it says the universal shade that adjusts to the natural color of brow hairs. It's said to be budge proof, sweat proof, and smear proof. And there's 0 0.07 grams of product in there. I keep hearing my dog, sorry. Next thing I got is the Rosemary Balancing Scalp Pack with Charcoal. This is what it looks like. It also says that this is the full size product. Here's what it says about this one. Detoxifying charcoal helps balance oil production, redness, irritation. If the scalp is itchy, then it'll help with the irritation with the help of organic botanicals. This is the full size product. It's 50 milliliters and the price is $4 if you want to buy this. So I'll let you know how that works once I use it. The next thing I got in my bag is this. This is the Luna Liner, Liner Eyeliner. It's supposed to be vegan and cruelty free, not tested on animals, by Seraphine Botanicals. Pretty cute packaging. It has a micro tip jet black color payoff fade proof water resistant vegan formula this is the full size once again which is three full size products out of five this month that's pretty good um, it says that it has two grams of product in it and the retail price is eighteen dollars so that's pretty good to get in a twelve dollar subscription bag if i can get it open all right. Here's what that looks like. It's a marker tip, and it does go on pretty black, so that's pretty cool. The last thing that I got in my box this month are these Sakura face pads. They're said to tone, moisturize, exfoliate with gentle PHAs which loosen the glue that holds together dead skin cells for a better exfoliation for all skin types including sensitive 
It has a gentle side and a textured side on each pad, and it comes with 10 pads. This is the sample size, and I couldn't find how much these retail for, but it says that this is also vegan and cruelty-free. So that's pretty cool. These are what these look like. Sakura Radiance Peeling Pads. I think that's really cute packaging. I wish that it came with more than 10 pads, but that's also cool. But well, that's all that I got in my Ipsy bag this month. Thank you guys for watching, and please comment, like, and subscribe. Bye. If the scalp is itchy, it, it's a micro lip. What? What the hell am I saying? It's a liner. Is the Luna Liner Eyeliner. It's supposed to have a micro tip. It's jet black. The Luna Line. What is that? That's all that I got in my Ipsy bag. This. That's all. The gentle side and 